For many years, our 2012 Toyota Tacoma has been the primary tow vehicle for the Overland Humvee trailer in many of our adventures. Now, she's getting an upgrade. Today, we're going to explore the addition of the four-wheel campers, Project M. Let's go. The bed of this truck was set up as a cargo space, not a living space. It worked well as a tow vehicle, but it limited our travels to places where we must bring the trailer as a separate base camp. To make room for the upgrade, we must remove everything in the back of the truck. We then sent the truck to four-wheel campers for the installation of the Project M. The Project M is a topper. It is not a slide out which makes it lighter compared to other campers of the same footprint. This means we can still tow our trailer if we need a base camp, but have the option to only take the truck for more challenging trails. There are six external latches that hold the top part of the roof in place while driving. They must be unlatched before deploying. It is a pop top with soft sided materials which allow standing room inside. It deploys and breaks down in less than two minutes. This is perfect for long trails when we set up camp just for a night and continue on the next day. To deploy the rear side, unlatch the rear panel and push up on this blackboard in the middle. Loop the strap around this hardware and snap it in place. To raise the front side, use the push board to first seesaw the far front end up, then push it in place. Then snap the board in place. And there's a bed on this side. Now we're short people so we can lay this way. There's a fan up here but it doesn't have any power yet. We're gonna build our own battery box instead of getting it. That's how I'm about I'm short I'm like five foot four so I can stand here perfectly. Now if you look at this rail, you can slide this bed over this way. And push that over that way. And then down here you can add these cushions. And there's four cushions. One, two, three, four. And they go right here. So that's one, two, three, and then four. Uh, it comes with a lighting package over here, which is an adjustable light. Like I said, we don't have any power just yet. Uh, we're gonna build this kind of custom now this has a thermal pack so this is a thermal pack so it's attached there and this is the main skin that's on the outside but the thermal pack gives you a little bit extra insulation peel it off like so 
which comes with a window. And that's uh, still kind of like plastic. If you feel that even more, there's mesh on this side, mesh. And if you want, just, just want the light, you can leave that there. Um, if you want it blacked out, you can cover it with that. And of course, this thermal pack, extra insulation. So this is a short bed. So this is about, let's say one foot of clearance from the edge of that bed to the edge right here. So there's not much that you can kind of do while you're here. Um, so yeah, we're gonna have to figure something out. So this is gonna be designed in such a way that my wife and I can sleep up here if it's just the two of us, but we can slide it out like, like this so my kids can also sleep on there. Now, as soon as you push the bed all the way back, you have a lot more space over here. You have basically your entire bed here. All right, so the future plan for this is we're going to put a cassette toilet on this side. We're going to put a battery box on this side. And possibly a fridge on this side that slides all the way out to here. On top of this box, we're going to lay out these cushions so we can use it down here in couch mode, but still available so we can use it up here. For bed mode. To bring the roof down, you do every step in reverse. We will continue to add to this project and build, so stay tuned for updates. If you have any suggestions or questions, we would love to hear it. So please leave it in the comments. Thank you.